Hello everybody, Lawrence Fleming here again. Well, I'm up helping my son do some work, so I'm going to throw this video together real quickly for you. It's still just the same stuff, just slugging along. The government just passed the anti-survivability of our country bill that they call the anti-inflation bill. It's going to do nothing but harm this country and harm us, so you can't believe anything. Of all the things that have been going on where people should have had their houses raided, we get the president raided. Which basically tells you that any of us can be raided at any time if they don't like what we're doing. This site could just disappear, along with other sites, when they get to a point where they don't want to deal with us. We've got to have a rapture coming up soon, but I don't know when. Trumpets, maybe. But again, I tell you, it's not tied to an event. It's not tied to a Jewish event. We're not Jews. We're Gentiles. We're adopted. We don't have to do the Jewish laws. Paul mentioned that a couple of times, and so did uh, Peter. That we don't have to do all that stuff. But if something else could happen during this time, we know that uh, Iran is probably pretty tired of dealing with Israel. I firmly believe they do have nukes. They may claim they don't, but that's only so they can get away with lying just like our country gets away with lying. There's a price to pay for that. Our country's going to be paying a price here big time soon. So that's why I think Trump does sound like a good possible time because what's going to happen is, is they're going to do something to make sure the election doesn't happen or happens so that they win. I can't see how they can win. They're scared to death of the big T. That's why they're trying to get him out of running. And I wouldn't put it past him to take him out physically if they can't take him out any other way. So keep an eye on that. So this video is going to be short because I can't, I don't have time today, I'm working and I'm just helping my son do his job. This is a two-man job, how to put up a overhang type thing on a porch and you can't put those up by yourself. Anyhow, so I'm at, I'm at uh, his place right now. It is, this isn't where he's doing it. we got to go pretty soon and go to the work. Got to go get gas in his car. All right. Keep the faith. Keep praying. Do the things I mentioned in the last video. Do them religiously. Because you're going to need it. Okay. And we'll talk again soon. Till we meet in the clouds, God bless.